And as you can see from some of that dramatic video, trying to drive through the flooded streets can pretty much be a dangerous endeavor. Right now we have Captain Raymond Studley from the Rhode Island State Police on the phone to talk more about what's going on in the roadways right now. What are some of the problem spots you're still seeing, Captain? Uh, at the present time, we currently have Route 6 East uh, shut down right at the Route 10 merge uh, due to uh, some f uh, flash flooding in that area. We're diverting the traffic onto Route 10 South from Route 6 East. Uh, we believe that should be cleared up. Uh, DOT crew is on scene, and that should be cleared up, and we should have that roadway open uh, within a, a half an hour or so. Okay, but no other problems that you know of at this point on some of our state highways? No, not at this point. Uh, Route 10 had been closed earlier this morning due to flash flooding, but uh, both north and southbound are, uh, are open at this time. And real, real quickly, any just word on um, any accidents that were weather-related this morning? Uh, we did have several accidents in the uh, Providence area due to the flooding. Uh, also, a number of disabled motor vehicles uh, that did get caught into the uh, drainage backups. All right, well, I know you're hard at work trying to keep the roadway safe this noontime. We thank you for your time. Okay, thank you.